May you always find your way to higher ground May you always keep your head held up high Pretty little thing You're a diamond in the rough Shining from within I can tell that you're tough Just the sight of you when I'm at my weakest point Makes a world of difference, oh you make me strong Pretty little thing You're a diamond in the rough Shining from within I can tell that you're tough Order in a cup of love Feel it rising up and above You will always keep my heart and soul strong Plant your seeds and watch them grow The light will always know where to go You will always keep my heart and soul strong You're the first thing in the morning and the last Baby, you're my future and you are my past Pretty little thing You're a diamond in the rough Shining from within I can tell that you're tough Order in a cup of love Feel it rising up and above You will always keep my heart and soul strong Plant your seeds and watch them grow The light will always know where to go You will always keep my heart and soul strong Silver lining 
DIY at home routine and I hope that it was somewhat insightful for you guys I know you guys love the routine videos they are one of my favorite ones to film because it's truly just what I do so today after I capped off work and my workout I shared a little bit about that with you guys there isn't very much that I can share about my current workout routine um, I will be able to divulge everything as of November 1st. I'm in what's called a test group right now. So we're basically working out the kinks, testing the program. You guys will have full access to it come December, but I will be able to talk about it throughout November and share all of the things. And I will 100% do a video on it and be able to share it with you guys. And I have a feeling that you're going to be all about it because it's honestly, it's kicking my butt. I'm obsessed with it. And it's, it's honestly changing my life. Like I just, I, I feel like I've found a new way of life and I love it, love it, love it. So one thing that I did want to share with you guys was a couple pieces of equipment, things that helped me get back on track. We did just get back from California. So using Sweet Sweat, I'm not sponsored by them or anything. I just love it. It's made from coconut oil, jojoba oil, other types of oil. It smells really, really good. And there's like the tube thing that's kind of like a stick that you just roll out or you can get like the tub of cream for it. It's on Amazon. I will link absolutely everything that I use in the video down below. That was the whole point of it is that you can just order it straight from Amazon to your doorstep and you can have your own pamper spa day. Everything that I use is pretty much all available online and most is on Amazon. So the sweet sweats on there, that sweet sweat band that I use, and that really helps me just de-bloat and shed the water weight whenever I get home from vacation, just kind of puts me back on track. And you can think that it's a gimmick, but I honestly love it. I just love the fact that you can just like sweat out the toxins. So I use that. I love traveling with that agility ladder. I love traveling with those peach bands. I will link all of that down below. And you guys saw me drinking my my pre-workout all day. I'm still drinking it. I, I love it so much. So it's an all natural pre-workout. I will link that down below. The cuppy that you guys keep asking about, all of my cups pretty much this season are all from the Disney store. They're just too perfect. This glows in the dark, I love them. So I put a little bit of Mio in it because I got to try the new fruit punch flavor of the pre-workout that I drink. It's like an all natural pre-workout. It's clean. You still get like the zing when you want to go, but the fruit punch version has not launched yet and I'm obsessed with it because I did get to try it. So I just add a little touch of Mio in there. It's delicious. So the other thing that I did after, you know, my workout was finished, I had a little bit of food and I went upstairs and I did a hair mask. I did a face mask. The face mask is one of the best face masks ever. It by no means smells good. It by no means um, does nothing. It's not one of those like rejuvenating, like moisturizing types of face mask. It literally like rips a layer of your skin off, but in the best way ever. It's a deep pore cleansing face mask. It's a clay mask. It's Indian clay. I will link it. You mix with apple cider vinegar. I know that sounds really weird. And I used an applicator to do it. Best face mask ever, but it does make your face like, I think I've got my color normal again, but you'll see in the video how red my face gets at the end of it. And then from there, I did an exfoliator. I used my my tool to get all of the gunk out, my microdermabrasion tool that's also from Amazon. My hair masks are from Lush and they work really, really well. Add a little bit of a tub time with some bubbles. And then from there, I did my nails while I watched Riverdale. It's some candles. I'll link all the candles and all of that stuff down below as well. You guys, I can't even with Riverdale. And I have no one to nerd out about it with except for one of my friends and coaches, Kinsley, whom I love. Kins, I love you so much. Andre thinks I'm insane. Will one of you guys at least talk to me about Riverdale because it's, it literally is the, I could make a whole video about Riverdale. I remember I saw a video that I had filmed this time last year. I was like, yeah, I'm trying Riverdale. I don't really know what I think about it. 
Who are you, Angie? It's the greatest show ever. So season three just started. I'm like right up to date with episode two, season three, and it is amazing, amazing. I will also link just Halloween vibes. I will also link this shirt down below for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye, dudes. Bye.